nobody Cause I don't wanna hurt nobody Alright you guys, we are back with our another vlog Um, we just came from working out Right now, I'm in the middle of driving Like finishing the load We're heading to Tennessee from Where the heck are we? Where are we at, Gail? Oh. Kentucky We are in Kentucky Oh Sit down Okay, so Things are going good. Y'all see I decorated my truck. If you didn't watch that video, go watch it. I'll show you guys how I mount my TV and everything. Um, this look. <laughs> Why are you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, we're back. Giggle is a weirdo sometimes. Anyway, I also cut my hair. I got a little bobby bob because I was feeling real ball. I still like it. Like, you know how you cut your hair and then you're like know if i like it i still like my vibe so that means it's a good choice i look grown and sexy anyway um i'm just chilling right now i've been driving i was driving earlier then like i said i went worked out at the beginning of the video and i'm about to just like chill here until my time comes back in like two hours and then we're gonna be getting up and moving around um I'm gonna go and take a shower at the Loves. I usually take it at the Planet Fitness, but apparently this Planet Fitness closes at like seven o'clock. So, 7.30 or something like that. And they were like, hey y'all, y'all gotta leave. Like they were flicking on and off the lights. That's kind of crazy, but it's okay. Cause I just found this, excuse me. I just found this Planet Fitness just like out of nowhere. So, yeah, where am I actually? I'm in Indiana. Yeah, I'm in Indiana. And we will be in Louisville soon. Like, we'll be passing through. Um, yeah, that's all. Like, we can talk about some other stuff later. But right now, I'm going to chill and watch my show on my TV that I mounted myself. Call me Builder Builder T. Builder Builder Rose. Right, Giggle? Tell the people, hey. Tell them, tell them I'm not holding you against your will. All right. What you want? He want he he likes to be all on me, and I told him to get off me, so he would be staring at me. Anyway, talk to you later. Bye. Good morning. So we are up. Yes, I slept through all the night into the morning till five o'clock. But like I said, I don't have to be there until like five in the evening. So I still had twelve hours to get there. I'm gonna get there around eleven o'clock and then that's still too early because this is a warm up love. Um I am behind like I said a plan of fitness and I am about to drive out the the street cleaners is outside. That's how early it is. Um yeah, did all my duties, did all my duties, brushed my teeth in this truck, all that, all that. Um, you know, I, I be having dreams, like, my dreams, I don't know if they're a reflection of my, uh, my conscience, because they're so out of this world, it's crazy, but this dream, I'm gonna just tell y'all about it, because the, okay, so in this dream, like, um, I had to move all my stuff like I had to move my stuff to storage and it was obviously in Atlanta I believe um and I was like on the top of Atlanta and my storage was like somewhere in Madonna or something like that and so I had to borrow someone's car and it was this person that I was talking to but when we was on the phone we had like a group chat and the person that I was talking to started talking to everybody else it was just weird so then I, I still, they still were like, do you need me to help you move your stuff? Da, 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 da. And I was like, yeah. Um, so we went, packed the car up, the car, I won't say his car, her car. I don't know if this person was like a boy, girl. Anyway, we went to pack the car up um, and we started moving. This girl came out of nowhere and was like, why are you in my car? Like, why are you in my car? Why is your stuff in my car? Like, I was just like, oh, da 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 I said that I can move my stuff, right? So she's arguing. I'm just like, can I just 
you know, move to storage and nothing to give your car back. Like, it's no big deal to me. But, I mean, honestly, I, I also wasn't getting upset because I'm like, I understand. Like, if somebody was in my car, I'd be upset too. But I just needed to move my stuff to storage to 7 third. She was having an attitude. She was being mad and everything. And then we fought, y'all, and I beat her up. But someone recorded it and put it online. So, it was like a whole bunch of people talking about her. But after that, she let me use her car. Like, what? What kind of dream was that? And then my arm started hurting in my dream. And, like, I kept going like this in my dream. And it was like, you got to help so we can put up. Because she started moving all my stuff to this big container. And I was like, how are we going to move this big container um, with your small-ass Toyota? Like, what's going on? So when she said I could use her car, we had to move all the stuff. So I'm moving all the stuff, and my arm started hurting. And they're like, you going to help us move the stuff? And I'm Long story short, my arm started hurting because I was sleeping on my arm and I woke up and that's why we are up right now. Anyway, so, <laughs> yeah, I've been having dreams like that. Like, I don't even know if that has a meaning. It seemed like I just, I just be dreaming. I dream like a lot, like every night. Um, yeah, anyway, let's go on the road. Oh, watching my vlog my trucker vlog so right now we are in nashville tennessee we're in the middle of a load right now um i picked up from Ken kentucky i was gonna say kennesaw for some reason but kentucky and i'm on my way to shelbyville nashville i um stopped at this mall that i usually stop at uh green hill mall and everyone's surrounding me but hopefully in two hours they're gone because i need to be at my load at 5 30 and it is 2 24 so we have two hours three hours but two hours because i need to leave i need to be out of here by 4 30 at least but they put mall closes at six today because it's a sunday so more than likely i'll still be out now we're about to um we're about to be heading to dallas my next load is to Dallas, and I asked them to send me to Dallas because I'm meeting some friends out there, and you know, just everything. So we're gonna we're gonna see what they have me doing, you know, because he found me a load. My dispatcher, shout out to my dispatcher because he's the best dispatcher. I'm not gonna say it because I don't want no one else harassing him because I have some people harass him because he is a great dispatcher. So boom. Um, I don't know if I told you guys, if y'all watched my last vlog. Or in my last video, I uh, showed you guys me decorating my truck. And I showed you guys I got a haircut. I got a haircut. Yeah, I love it. I honestly love it. It's giving rich, grown woman. Okay, 30s. This is the 30s. So, um, yeah. I'm about to just chill until these people move from beside me. Because, like I said, they're right around me. I'm going to show you in a minute. But, um, yeah, I'm going to wait until they move. And then we're going to head to Shelbyville, Tennessee, which is only... 50 mi minutes away 50 miles so it's 50 like 55 minutes away from me right now and um yeah we're gonna be there on time because that's the only way okay so we've made it to the shipper oh no the receiver i'm just waiting for them to finish unloading my truck um Hi guys it's the next day um i would be on my way to my next load but things happen as we know in ring fair so last night when i was dropping out my load for walmart they left 75 cases on my truck they said um something about sell by date the date on the juices said december 8th so i don't know if it's too early or too late um so now i'm just sitting here waiting for claims to let me know what to do with these 75 cases like we're waiting for the um shipper to let us know what they want us to do with it which is annoying because like i said i'm supposed to meet my friends in dallas i made the plans everything was set up i had my pre-plan and i was supposed to be on my way there but now i'm sitting here still waiting for them to let me know what's going on with this trailer so of course i'm a little upset because i'm just like oh 
I should be gone. It's a little chilly or whatever. Not really. It's chilly a little bit. Probably like, why you got your windows down there? Because I was blow drying my hair and it got smoky in here. Anyway, that's besides the point. So, while we wait, like I said, I'm irritated. I'm like really ready to just like be on the road, like heading towards Texas. So I could be off for my two days. I've already called and asked them like so what we're looking like and like we haven't heard anything yet but we're gonna send them another message boom so like two more hours go about three more hours but I'm now I'm just sitting here and as you know if you're sitting you're not making no money so I called them like can you guys figure out what I need to do to get this trailer off of me and my dispatcher was like I'm working on that right now because it's just not fair for me to be sitting here with 75 cases none of this is my fault you know I got the delivery here safe and sound and now I'm sitting here having to wait for these people to let me know what to do with some chips. That's the most annoying thing. So, I just don't understand why I just couldn't take it. Like, throw it away. I don't know. Take it. Like, what you want me to do with it? What you reject it for on my trailer? Anyway. <laughs> um, so, yeah. We're waiting. And, yeah. In that case, very well. I'm Except just ready challenge. to go. Okay, you're on. You're well, on. I just wanted to let y'all know. Then. I'll show y'all the juice. Other is the Italians. Italians. All right, guys. I am at the at a donation center. I just donated those um, 75 cases of Minute Maid. Yeah. I like when we do that instead of throwing stuff away. Like sometimes we gotta throw away like tomatoes and stuff. But. I love when I can go to a donation center and just drop them off. So they just finished taking it off my truck. Um, I have to leave. I'm waiting on another load. Hopefully I get that same load I had before they took it off because of this. Because I need to go. Let's see. They just messaged me. All right, y'all. We're going to get some fuel. Um, let's get some fuel. Take that much for me to be like if 
you close your curtains, like I have curtains in my truck. When I close my curtains in my truck, it covers the front of my truck anyway. Like it covers right here where they're gonna put the camera. So I mean, like, and then I close the back curtains because obviously, like, I don't want people to see me inside there, so they're not gonna really see me. Um, I don't do anything. I don't do anything wrong. I don't be on my phone. I use, I have my seatbelt on. Like, we'll see if they want. Like they get annoyed by me putting my strap behind my back but honestly I don't I don't think they will like after they see me driving for a, a while and they see me put it behind my back I don't think they'll be like hey and when we're making love uh, your cries they can be heard from far and wide it's only the two of us Into your eyes, I see it. You're all I need. Every time I get a bit inside, I feel it. Yes, I have connected to my trailer. Sorry, it's loud over here. But I connected to my trailer. I'm about to. You know pick it up and everything i'm checking my um around the trailer right now because you know you always gotta do a nice little inspection um i already checked the tires and stuff but i'm going to check the seal make sure everything is looking good <laughs> my lock on here hold on for a second while giggle because i need him to be able to use the bathroom because we're not stopping we're about to get on the road um yeah, I already got the fuel and everything. Everything's looking good with this trailer, so we're good. We're good. We're good. Um, this is gonna be a, a easy one. I'm glad everything was ready by the time I got here because Lordy. And you know what else I'm happy about? I'm happy that this load. Hey, get back over here. Giggle. Get back over here. Come back underneath the ding. Y'all, why have you such a hard-headed dog? Like, I don't know. Maybe he get it from me. I don't know. Anyway, I'm happy that this load was more than the load I got the first time. So, obviously, it was a little blessing, you know? Even though it was annoying having to wait that long, trying to figure out what they were going to do with those pallets. But it all paid off in the end. It always pays off. You know, you can trip to yourself, but don't, don't take that energy everywhere you go. Yeah. So... Everything's right with this trailer. Just waiting on getting it to finish, using the bathroom, poop pee, all that stuff, and then we're heading back on the road. This um, facility, it's like, it goes in a circle, like you don't come out the same way you came in, so we're gonna be going a whole other way. I gotta go on a scale and everything, make sure I'm not overweight, da da da, blue da blue. And then we're gonna be ready to go. Yeah. I'm also going to slide my Tim's right here because I've got enough space. So let's get that done right now because I don't feel like doing it later. slide my tandems as y'all saw that said 37 is my trailer and that's that's too much i need it to be under 34 so when i get out of here i'm gonna slide my tandems gotta get a break don't want to have to go into the way station for nothing for nothing <laughs> Okay guys, we are done driving for today. Excuse my hair, just leave, leave me alone. <laughs> um, I am 470 miles away 
from Dallas, so we finished a good bit today. We uh, did 600 miles today, actually. I'm trying to figure out where the uh, 600 came from because I know I did like 500 today. So something, something happened, something happened, but that's good. Um, I'm walking Giggle right now because you know my baby got to be outside. So we're going to stay out here for a good 30 minutes and then I'm going to go and take a shower. Giggle threw up on my dang carpet, my new carpet. So yeah, I got to go put it in the washing machine. Y'all know I'm a little upset because I'm obsessed with Hello Kitty, but it's okay. As long as my baby okay. Um, Yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a good day still. Life's good. I'm good. Good is good. Yeah. Y'all come get your money. last leg of the race we are almost to texas right now i'm glad this is both like a pickup and a drop because it's, it's both ways drop a hook so i don't even have to like get unloaded or anything i just gotta go and i got 72 hours giggle get off of those ant pals dang what is up with my dog y'all i don't know he is a little cuckoo in the head yeah no thoughts all right y'all we are on the road well we're getting on the road right now we're leaving the loves and it's kind of popping I'm starting a little late, I'm not gonna lie. I wanted to start at 8, but I'm starting at 8.30. It's all good though. <sighs> Time to get the day started. You know, I wanted, like I was trying to wait for Chester's to open. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I wanted a chicken sandwich, but they were still closed and I need to leave. So we'll probably grab some later. I got boiled eggs for breakfast and a shake. I don't have any pastries, which is not me. So as soon as I see somewhere I can grab a donut or something, I'm gonna grab it. I know y'all like, dang girl, you gonna get a donut? Like, watch your figure, but <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> so yeah, we're on the road. We be done. Truck driver team. I guess y'all don't know my real name. She has vacation is over and i'm back on the truck i am at our the prime the prime yard in texas in dallas picking up a trailer and i'm on my way to a u.s cold storage to pick up a load and then tomorrow well i'm gonna be there tomorrow my load is in um texas it's still in texas i forgot what the city was and i'm not looking at it because i'm looking at the u.s cold storage um location on my GPS right now. So, we're about to head there. My vacation was cute. It was good. It was only a day, so whatever. I don't think I'm taking off for, for uh, Thanksgiving. I mean, unless my mama go, you know, unless she be like, girl, I want to see you real bad, and you need to get down here. Then I might make it, but no, probably not. Um, right, my hair is right now. I'm sleepy. <laughs> I'm tired. Like, I'm, I'm rested, but tired like and i'm ready to just pick up this load and i'm gonna take like a little nap it's 11 minutes I mean 11 miles away but there's a lot of traffic so it might take me a minute to get there all right let's get on the road
finally done we just came from being outside walking giggle it is so cold it's cold out here on the other side of texas the sun just came out though so maybe we'll get a little better but 40 degrees it's 40 degrees out here and i must have head to new mexico and i just looked at the um weather there and it's 35 degrees so yeah we're dealing with that right now but that's the end of our vlog i'm happy you guys came because this vlog was freaking everywhere it was no organization but y'all stuck it out so shout out to y'all Shout out to me, and shout out to God, of course. And shout out to Giggle. He like, girl, what the heck you picking me up for? But yeah, y'all. So we'll see you next week. Bye.